Korespondensi CNN Richard Quest memiliki ilustrasi penjelasan tentang dugaan cara kerja skema Panama Papers yang meliputi banyak negara di seluruh dunia. Simak ulasan pembawa acara Quest Means Business ini. The Panama Papers reveal a complex scheme and web of intrigue that goes across the globe. Those who were using the offshore companies, the clients, did so by hiring intermediaries. 14,000 banks, law firms and other middlemen. The main destinations were Hong Kong, the United Kingdom, Switzerland and the United States. Now, it's these intermediaries that dealt with Mossack Fonseca in Panama City. In fact, Mossack Fonseca may not even have known the true identities and owners of all the various shell companies that they set up. But they were setting up these shell companies and these nominees on an industrial scale. There were 113,000 set up in the Caribbean around the British Virgin Islands, followed by 48,000 in Panama itself. And then, of course, you've got those out in the Western Pacific that were also set up. Now, there is no doubt that many of these offshore companies were set up for entirely legitimate purposes. But the size and scale of this operation and the people who were involved leads perhaps no one in any doubt that there were also nefarious motives, which would have included the avoidance of tax, money laundering, shielding from creditors and spouses, and, of course, the avoidance and dodging of sanctions. And once again, it's on a global scale. Richard Quest, CNN, New York.